Good morning, it's still kind of morning, it's almost noon and I'm just recording my video. Uh, this video comes in six parts, maybe seven parts. Right now, six parts. First, last Wednesday, I went and I got new clothes. This is not new clothes. This is old clothes. And I also got a haircut. Like, it's this long and they cut over half of it off. Oh my god, I got so much hair. But it, the price of clothing is outrageous. I mean, what? Last year, we spent around $300. And I got almost, so I'd say almost uh, one and a half times what I got this year. This year, it was $600 for the clothes. Like, holy damn. Like, the $300 last year included a new pair of shoes. Including a new pair of shoes this time, it would be like, what, um, three seven or six seventy, six seventy, six hundred and seventy. Holy shoot. That's a lot of money to spend on clothes. I start school next Monday. I don't want to go to school. I got all my stuff ready and everything, except I'm only in like one or two classes for some reason. I don't know why. I'm supposed to be in like six. I've got PE and chemistry. And I don't know why. Okay. That was the first part and the second part is it's a puppy sized elephant. Well, not quite puppy sized. It's a little bit smaller than puppy sized, but it's about the same size as the puppy over there. The small one. Not the other ones. They're a little bit bigger. But that, the puppy sized elephant thing is really funny because when I was in Michigan for my grandmother's funeral a month or so ago, we were driving and my mom, to distract my nephew, she says, look over there, look at that. And he's like, what is it? I'm just like, it's a puppy sized elephant. Look, there's a purple one. And my nephew was obsessed with puppy-sized elephants the rest of the time that we were there. It was hilarious. On the way back, when we came through the same spot, he was staring into the woods looking for the puppy-sized elephants. He claims that he saw one. He saw a puppy-sized elephant in nature. The day before yesterday, I was in a music video. Uh, it was for my kind of brothers band and it was awesome like there were uh, around 140 people supposed to be there who said they were going to be there and like 50 more that said or wait no it was like 70 more that said they might be there and there were like 30 people there but we had a great time everybody enjoyed themselves there were little kids there and stuff and before they played the song they were like little kids prepare yourselves and they start playing and it's all like soft Taylor Swift type stuff and then Rah! their band is called Through the Darkness they do like screamo type stuff it's really cool because they do a really good job with it they did a cover of Taylor Swift's Trouble it was great be nuts are not your mouth salted for your pleasure sure is Amazing. It's -a me, -a Mario. What you just saw was Mario sitting on an Atario. Yes, I I find that funny that he's over there. But yeah, I, I just figured that I'd show you that. I think I'm cutting off a part or two. I don't know. The game in the Atari was Space Invaders, which I enjoy. I have a cutting board over there that I don't use as a cutting board because it's got a space invader etched into it, like laser. I made it in school. It was awesome. It was awesome. I just finished editing the video and wow, was that fun. I think this is the best video I've made so far and I think it's the best because I used an outline instead of a script. I knew what I was going to say but not really exactly what I was going to say and I think that was a good idea.